Welcome back to a brand new Clash of Clans video, guys. My name is Chief Pat, and today we're going to be doing something crazy and using 300 of the new troop against a base. Now, you guys are probably wondering how this is possible. Don't worry, you actually can't do this within the game. It requires using the developer build. So, Supercell was nice enough to let me try it out and check out all of these boulders going into the base. I set up a nice line of jump spells, seeing as I have unlimited jump spells as well. Gonna go ahead and throw all the boulders on the bottom left and the bottom right. Watch them go into the base, and rocks are gonna be rolling around like crazy and destroying everything in their path. Okay, so a couple more jump spells look like they expired. Uh, just gonna use 24 jump spells like just any normal raider would. Bowlers are hopping over the wall. They're making their way into the core of the base, and I'll have to try some rage spells in another raid just to see how fast these guys can throw the rocks and to see how they work out. Okay, so a little bit more of the base left on the top left and the top right. Gonna go ahead and just drop the rest of our bowlers and they're gonna start massacring the top over there. And uh, this is pretty insane. If I was an Eagle Artillery, I don't know what I would even target because there's so many bowlers to go to. Uh, looks like a couple of the bowlers are attacking a wall at the same time. Might take a while for those guys to get out, but as the bowlers make their way into the core, hopping over giant bombs and even some of them dying, they'll finally make their way to the town hall take it out and end up giving us that three-star victory. So if you guys are looking for an OP strategy, 300 bowlers is definitely the one. Let's go ahead and try them out with a couple of different spells though and find some other base designs as well. So what a great raid there, 300 uh, bowlers, 35 jump spells, as well as we got some good trophies and resources, which of course you know you need inside of developer build. Let's go ahead and attack, attack this next base here, which is a poor Town Hall 10, which is about to feel the wrath of the max boulders. Okay, so starting out on the bottom left and the bottom right, they're gonna surround the base. Those are so many bowlers. Let's drop a couple of jump spells as well so they don't walk all the way around the base. This guy is in a lot of trouble. We can start moving some of the bowlers on the top left, and this one might be a little bit quicker of a raid. I sort of started mostly on the bottom on the last one, but I'm gonna keep it even Stevens for this one as the bowlers make their way through. Looks like the bowlers are demolishing that town hall altogether, which is insane with all those rocks being thrown. And uh, this one is going to be a pretty quick raid and a pretty dead Town Hall 10. All right, well, 93%. Looks like only a couple of defenses left in the center as the Bolums make their way there. That was insane. And let's go ahead and just try out one more raid with 300 bowlers, and that'll wrap it up for today's video. So I've used jump spells, I've used the bowlers themselves. Let's try to use some different spells inside of this one. Maybe we can use some rage spells or some hay spells to see how fast these bad boys can move. Okay, so it looks like we got the same base right here. Taking a look at what we wanna do, I guess we can use some wall breakers if we really wanted to. We don't have to use all those jump spells, uh, but I mean, if you have 300 of them, why should we care? Let's go ahead and layer some jump spells on the very bottom. Bowlers are going down right now, and as they make their way through the bottom, I'm just spamming with three fingers, getting all the bowlers out, or bowlers out on the field. Now I'm dropping the rage spells, and some raged bowlers are making their way into the base. And uh, this is the saddest Town Hall 10 I've ever seen with all of these bowlers attacking. Attacking from the top left, attacking from the top right. They're throwing rocks over the wall and making it all the way into the core of the base without even needing the jump spells in the very beginning. I still have 100 bowlers left to drop if I can get them all out at once. Looks like we're already in the core of the base with 93% done. That's going to wrap it up for this raid. And a bowler madness was had inside of this video. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you drop a like. Again, this was done on a Supercell developer build. Nothing you can do inside of the real game. Uh, but yeah, that's gonna do it for this video. Until next time, I will see you guys later. Peace out.